Waverly Hills was originally a two-story wooden building that was opened in 1910, however the building you see today was constructed in 1926. It served as a tuberculosis hospital throughout the early to mid-20th century, a time when the disease was at its worst. It is believed that as many as 63,000 patients died there. The death toll as well as the supposed mistreatment and questionable experimental procedures on patients, are all recipes that may be behind one of the most haunted buildings in the whole of the U.S. The Waverly Hills Sanatorium has built quite the reputation over the years as more and more people are allowed to investigate the premises. This has thrown up some incredible evidence over the years. It has featured on shows such as Ghost Adventures, Ghost Hunters Taps, and our very own Most Haunted. Taps captured a figure on their thermal imaging camera that seemed to be walking across the hall. The figure was about three feet tall. They later found out that the ghost of a young boy named Tim has been spotted.